today we're going on an adventure. I kind of want to go out and dip my toe in the water, per se. And by water, I'm talking about, well, I, I guess technically the water, because I want to head across land and kind of go exploring for something a little special out there. But that's not really the gist of it. The water is like the minorest part of the world. I basically just want to head out and go on an adventure. And I'm a little bit torn on whether we want to take a dinosaur with us or if we want to just set off by land or hand, by, by so, solo, solo, lone wolf style. You know what I mean? With bandit on my shoulder, of course, because this little fella is, is keeping me nice and warm in this tropical environment that most certainly doesn't get very cold. It doesn't matter though. <laughs> we're, uh, we're getting to that point where we can actually go and start doing some pretty special stuff and getting some pretty special teams. And I basically want to go out and do exactly that. So um, with our new little stash of narcotics, we're not going to waste any time. I need to craft up some trank arrows so we can really knock some big fellas out. Uh, we should probably also just get some regular arrows because well, then I can get more Trank Arrows, obviously. It's it's kind of self-explanatory. You guys know how this whole situation works. Um, but yes, the more arrows, the better at this point, really. And it seems as though... I was going to say, I'm missing something. It's just a little bit of thatch. Hey, I just want to show, throw a massive shout out to everyone out there who's enjoying the videos and enjoying the start to Ark Survival Ascended. What's really exciting is a lot of people... Well, mods. The first batch of mods have reached ASA. And I wanted to ask you guys for your opinion on the matter on whether I should keep this world majoritarily vanilla or if we should lean into the very slightly quality of life mod experience. We can do a little bit of testing with them. They can come and go, nothing really set in stone, but I want to hear your feedback. So let me know down below in the comments what you think. And um, yeah, I'm just interested in kind of tailoring this to what you guys would like to see. So uh, have your say. Now that I've got my arrows though, it's time for us to venture out. And um, first things first, I guess I need to... Yeah, work out if we're going to bring anyone with us. We've got old Triceratops here who still has no name. But if you have any ideas, let me know down below in the comments. I will be naming him tomorrow. But you've got like one last chance to get a name in for him. Um, I just had to take care of that bird before he took care of me. Uh, you know what? I think we're just going to go in by foot, by hand. Uh, so I'm going to go and level myself up a few times while I craft up another bunch of arrows i'm probably not going to craft all 52 of those i'm just going to leave them let them sit there for a second uh let's put a level into fortitude let's put a level into melee damage let's put another level into melee damage and then a little bit of stamina just in case i need to outrun a dinosaur and let's go and see what we have unlocked by doing so scissors i don't know why i unlocked that i don't have the resources for it but i just kind of got excited at the idea of a haircut um <laughs> We can, uh, we can obviously ride around on a lot more dinosaurs now. So that's pretty sweet. A sickle! We can get a sword. Oh, there's some actually interesting stuff here. Mammoth saddle, but we're nowhere near the snow biome. Um, yep, I'm going to stop that right there. And we also had a few more things down there. Hold on, what have we gotten to? A toilet. I can do poopoos, which might actually not be a terrible idea. But we've also got ghillie armor. <gasps> okay, well, I know what I'm looking for today then. We need ourselves organic polymer. In fact, I might have some. This will be super duper handy. I've got five of them. Yo, I can, I can, I can get, um, I can either get ghillie gauntlets or a ghillie mask or ghillie. No, that's it. Or boots. What am I lacking here? It really doesn't make a difference. Let's do the gauntlets. Why not? And now we're going to go kill some Hesperonuses or at least we got to look for them. Yo, we got more armor protection. No, um, what did I do? Aha, uh -huh, there we go. Uh, well, I'll just unequip those. We'll just get them out of here. Replace them with a bunch of leaves. That's right. The new ghillie armor looks absolutely amazing. This is going to give us a little bit of extra protection from dinosaurs' eyes, I suppose, because that's really all it's going to protect us from. All right, let's go. Let's just swim across, and we're going to explore until we find something of interest or nothing of interest. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see where this journey leads us to. Starting out, though, our first encounter is this little guy. You are beautiful, a level 35 Dilu. Um, no, thank you very much, but I will take that height because who knows if I'm going to need it for some armor soon. And uh, look at me. I'm pretty much disguised. Look at these little hands. <laughs> we got a long, we got a long way to go before we're fully disguised in this. Hold on, I'm being chased by something. What is it? What is it? I can hear it, but I can't see it. And I'm kind of terrified of it. We're really not going to be able to see like, hey, hey, oh, 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 hey, oh, 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 
poor little dodo. I didn't even see him there. Yeah, I didn't even think it was the dodo. It was this guy. It's another Pangramas Dax. What did you take from me? What did you take? I don't think I got it back, whatever it was. I think he stole some berries because it looked like he was starting to tame up, which is actually <laughs> kind of funny. These Pangramas Dax are just throwing themselves at me. Hey, buddy. Raw prime fish meat. Unfortunately, I do not have any of that. Um, ooh, we got a Triceratops over here. Whoa. Okay, these sticky Pangramas Dax just disguised themselves so well and that one is gone i don't know where that one went oh well we're just gonna keep on moving there's a baby triceratops oh you little cutie ah uh, one thing oh brontosaurus hey big fella or say is that something up? oh no that's just his tail i saw some like tree roots hanging from the top there and i was like what is that uh it's just this guy's tail just morphing through the land um hey big fella i'm not used to seeing brontos in this little canyon down here but uh, how you doing? What level are you? I'm nowhere near ready to tame up a Brontosaurus, obviously. I'm just kind of intrigued. Uh, I should be really be careful, though, because if something aggroes... Oh, it's level 20. If something aggroes it, it's definitely going to one-shot me with that giant old tail of his. But what a beautiful beast. It looks like he wants to follow us and say hello. But uh, we should set our sights and keep our eyes forwards. Hey, uh, how you doing? Sorry. Sorry, copies. But now you guys are just going to be dust to me um i don't have the meat to tame you guys so I, I, well i don't need to kill you but i'm going to <laughs> sorry I'm, i apologize okay i am kind of like wondering if i should stick to the high ground but when have i ever made smart decisions with my life right oh it's a little juvenile dodos oh, it's a little baby dodos and we've got another itchy thornus on our tail don't we we most certainly do well i'm gonna keep on moving and I can see something up here. I can hear a raptor up here. He's fighting a turtle. Um, oh, it's an alpha raptor. No, 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 no. Hold on. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Um, I mean, I could jump in there and help it out, but no chance. No chance. No chance. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold your horses. An alpha raptor. Um, I'm not ready for that. I got to. Now, now I need high ground. No, there's, now there's no questions asked about it. I really got to get to some high ground. And I kind of want to like, I kind of want to get its attention, but like not so much that it aggresses me too badly. I can't even work my way through this foliage right now, man. There's too many bushes. Maybe that works in my favor because I've got some gilly gauntlets on me. Um, oh, I'm hungry and thirsty. Oh man, okay. Not ideal, especially when I'm nowhere near water. Um, can I run up this cliff? The problem is if I can, so can it. But it has not seen me yet. Okay, good. Or has it? Hold on. Oh, no, he has. Oh, he's totally going to track me. He's got the spot now. What am I doing? Why am I here right now? No, no, no. Please don't. Please don't. Just uh, just uh, please be like a level five and I can like kill you. He's getting pretty bloody. No, he's so close. He's a oh, he's a level 115. <laughs> it's just a regular Raptor 2. I was like, there's no way I'm killing a level 115 Alpha Raptor right this sec. Yeah, okay, that, that explains it. I should have tamed the darn thing. What was I thinking? I've got a bowler. There were so many ways out of that, and I blew them all. Hold on. I thought I had a supply drop, but I guess not. Oh, I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. All right, that's fine. It's not too far away from us. We can get back there in a jiffy, which is exactly what I'm going to do. I hope I didn't damage it too much. I... Get out of here, Piranha. What's your problem? I 100% need to. <laughs> Sorry, I can't get enough of the, the running animation. It just looks so darn janky. This is something off with it. <laughs> just the way he like puffs his chest out. Oh my goodness. All right. Well, that was that would have been an amazing tame for us right now. That would have been such a fantastic one. Also, what? I ran past and I kind of heard something and it had me a little concerned. Um, all right, we're probably coming at this from the wrong angle now because I'm all the way... No, we can kind of weasel our way down here. The downside is I need to somehow get my stuff and um, without without aggroing the raptor, which is going to be tricky. It's going to be a very, very tricky time. We're just going to have to... Oh, no. Is it still over there eating my body? It's definitely angry. I can hear it. All right, let's just get our stamina back because there's no point us... He's eating something. I bet you it's my dead body. All right, let's try and come at it from this direction. 
He's, he's right on my body. I know it. Dude, leave my poor body alone. I should have crafted a, a, a bowler. All right. This guy's really, really angry. What do you think? <laughs> should I just... I didn't even have my body still there. <gasps> oh, bandits. No! I, we were sitting right on top of bandits, dead body. I didn't even see it. But have a look at this. I've got my stuff back. I've got my stuff back. Hey, buddy. I don't appreciate what you did there. And now you must join my family. Do you see why I thought he was an alpha? She's got a bit of a red glow to her. It might be because she's like a, an alpha pack animal. I mean, she might be alpha of her squad rather than an actual alpha raptor. It's definitely not, well, it's obviously not an alpha raptor. We've worked that part out. But I was just totally thrown off by that mist. Now, it shouldn't take many arrows to knock you down, right? And rightfully so. Bandit, what was I thinking, buddy? Oh, you poor old thing. You didn't deserve that. I'm so sorry. Well, rip to another team of ours, I suppose. And you had a name as well, which just makes it even more painful. Um, well, look, I don't know. <laughs> this raptor's so well disguised down here. If I didn't know it was there, I wouldn't be taming it. Let me get my armor back on as well, just because obvious reasons. A little bit of protection. And um, yeah, I don't know. I guess this raptor is going to become the, the next member of the Swoliola tribe, which is... Pretty darn sweet, if you ask me. Well, I'm going to let it sit there. It's probably going to take a little bit of time to do that. Um, good level, though. Like, fantastic level. That's really nice. I'm, I'm, I'm really... I'm stoked with that. Um, you guys hear that? It's as if there's, like, tribe music. But it might just be a dinosaur doing dinosaur things. It's hard to tell sometimes. Rather interesting, though. Um, a lot of itchy thornuses in this canyon. I don't really like that. But let's keep on moving through and see if there's any nice dinosaurs in here. Is that a parasaur? No, that's Apache. Hi. Oh, it's been a while since I've tamed one of these. It's only a level 10, though. These guys are good at knocking things out. That would have been, like, a really, really good pickup. If it was, like, a slightly higher level, maybe. Um, that would have been fantastic. I could headbutt some dinosaurs down and hey, it's our first Mega Neuro Dragonflies. We'll get wrecked to you. Get wrecked to you too. What do you think this is? What do you think this is? I'm experienced with killing your little dudes. You may have carried me through my last most recent. Are you kidding me? I forgot about these ones. Or maybe they weren't Mega Neuro. They were just ants. Well, either ways, I may have befriended them in my most recent modded playthrough of Ark Survival Evolved, but not this time around. And my friends, do you know what we are currently looking at? This is a cave. We found the... Oh, my goodness. It's beautiful. <laughs> oh, I kind of want to, like, go in, but I kind of don't because I don't know what to expect. And we are most certainly not ready to go caving. But I kind of just want to get a feel for how this whole thing looks. Dude. I can, like, hear my footsteps echoing as we walk down. Oh, it looks so spooky in here. Oh, I love it. The lighting is amazing. I think for the most part, it's very similar. I don't even know why I'm entering this cave right now, but I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll question. Uh, I don't know. Hey, look, if we get too deep and things get a little out of hand, I'll worry about it then. Hey, rare flowers, rare mushrooms rather. Okay. Can we get some crystal inside of this cave? Yes, crystal. Gosh, data. That was a loud old clash, smashy sound. Crystal, we can get a spyglass. I can get water. Oh, I can't break you. Can I break these little... Hold on, these little ones to your side. Hold on, hold on. Yes! More crystal, baby! There we go. Uh, how about metal? Uh, I thought these might be metal because normally caves have metal nodes in them, but I guess it's not meant to be. Okay, then. Okay, then. Now I am officially excited. What do I need? Hide, fiber, wood. I might. Hold on, do I? I got hide. I got fiber. I need wood. I need like one tree. I got the hide. That's all I need, right? Where is it? Here. Just five pieces of wood. Oh, I should just head to the surface and smack a tree and then I can get a spyglass. But we'll do that once we get back to the surface, I suppose. For now, we're in this cave. And I must explore further. I must see what lies ahead. Or at least experience one little arachnid. Dude, this thing is amazing! Okay, okay, okay. All right, let's keep level-headed because we are almost certainly about to encounter some insects. This is usually the point, I think, where we start to see some little 
eight and ten legged freaks or maybe some no legged freaks there's a titan boa over here i really should turn back but spider snake <laughs> okay um even if this is like the easiest cave in the game i am not ready for it stop it oh i'm totally gonna go to sleep lucky i've got levels in fortitude yeah take that take that i thought you give me prime me not today i suppose not today all right um oh my torpor is actually it's actually pretty high all right let me kill at least one spider i don't know oh, there's a few spiders never mind <laughs> one on one i'll take it on but i don't know we're already kind of falling asleep you know what now nah, let's go let's go let's go let's go little the radio oh you gotta be kidding me this is not good for obvious reasons i didn't think he was gonna put me to sleep right that second come on well, I did that to myself, clearly, all right? I got no one no one to blame but me. I got a little bit carried away, a little bit excited. Um, hey, how you doing? Supply drop. What do you got inside of you? <gasps> Ooh! Woo -hoo -hoo! Ooh -hoo -hoo! Okay! These new supply drops are hitting nicely oh my goodness all right well for one i don't really care about the meat that is what it is we got some wool though that's not the easiest thing to find we got an amazing slingshot and a pretty darn good raptor saddle well i just so happen to have a raptor on the way so i guess we'll we'll well yeah let's go and i mean come on we got a raptor saddle it's meant to be the game just knew where we're at and it knew what I wanted. This is the best birthday ever. And it's not even my birthday. All right, I'm going to go for a run back to my stuff, which isn't... Well, it is down there, but I can't get to it. I have to run this way. Um, I'll see you guys once we're a little closer. And hopefully not dead. Oh, no, 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 please, no, 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 I can't run. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. No, 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 no. you i hate you why did i have to jinx it and say when i'm hopefully not dead all that did was make sure that we were most certainly dead i just realized we respawned at a random part of the map too this isn't this isn't my bed <laughs> we are a long way from home i'm pretty sure this is is this we are a long way from home. i don't even know where we are this is, is this where we built our first little house I might be able to run back from here. Yeah, this is Dodo Beach from episode one. From our first day. I mean, I could try. It's going to be a long shot, though. In all seriousness, though, if I make it across this watery chasm, we might have a good shot at this. Look, there's my old house. Just imagine if I left a bed in there. Wouldn't that just be the best thing in the world? Um, the good news is I'm going to run back to my raptor because by the time I get there, he might actually be, you know, completed taming. So that's good um but the unfortunate news is the saddle that i want to put on him is with the other raptor on my dead body bag um which which that might be a little bit trickier to get to but we'll see Ooh. oh no there's a dialer and i've got no stamina to outrun the darn thing i got excited by the ruin i was like yo we can get some experience i didn't even see that dialo oh uh, well <laughs> should i just should I just accept the inevitable right now? I don't think we're making it. Um, I mean, this water... Oh. <laughs> oh, there's water right there, which will quench my thirst and help me stamina-wise, but there's a spino in it. That's not at all what I want to be seeing. Maybe there is a chance, though. All right. All right, all right, all right. Get that water into me. And I should probably just replenish some stamina for the time being. You know, just in case this guy decides to pursue us, which would be absolutely atrocious luck. Um, but we're actually, we're actually pretty close. I think I can get there. Play a little bit of the floor is lava, or in this case, it's just water. Piranha infested, ant infested water. Go, go, go. There's ants coming. I refuse to die to ants. No, thank you. No, thank you. I'm not getting taken down by ants. No, 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 no. We're so darn close. We're so darn close. But now the question kind of becomes, do I head into the cave first or do I get to gather my raptor first? The cave means we get our items, weapons, and armor. The raptor means we have like muscle and power on our side. But hey, our raptor's right here. 
And I think that is the correct answer. He's got like one or two pieces of meat left to eat. I can use him to go and kill the other raptor. We can get the saddle, saddle him up, and then ride ourselves down into the cave. That is the plan. Hey, we've done it, baby. Level 166 raptor. All right, buddy. Unfortunately, I need you to go and earn your saddle. It's a little less than ideal, I know. But um, it's just it's just the way it's going to go, friend. It's just the way it's going to go. So if you could hop out of there and then head down there, eventually you're going to find your way. <laughs> you're going to run into one of your kind and I need you to protect me from it. You are the high level. You should be able to do it. This is so unorthodox. But you need to go and earn that, that saddle. Assuming the raptor is still here somewhere. I don't see it. But it doesn't matter. Because we've got it anyway. And on that note, we have a raptor. Well, we, we, we already had the raptor. But now we've got a raptor that we're riding around on. Woohoo! <laughs> All right. Now let's go ride it down into a cave and hopefully not sacrifice it in the, prog in the process. Because um, that would be absolutely a devil mistaking. Also, where is that cave entrance? How far did I head? All right, here it is. All right, well, it's time to redo this journey, except this time just a little bit different. Oh, and I'm thirsty again. Oh, no. Ah! It's right here. 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 They're both blue levels. Come on, buddy. You got this. Come on, 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 come on. It's level 55, but you're a level 166. Yes! Take that, you piles of trash. That is what you get. And just like that, I've got my stuff back and I'm turning back and I never should have come down here in the first place. But we got to see a cave and I got a raptor and I got to kill some spiders, which being an Australian, it's part of my blood. We got to do it. And I'm absolutely terrified of the little guys. But we also got crystal, which means a spy. Oh, you know what that means? Other than me being able to put armor on, it means... I've got... No, no, no. I need... I thought it was high that I needed. I need wood. Five wood. And the spyglass is all mine. Hey, success. Success. Success! We made it out alive. My armor is butchered to bits, but doesn't matter. We're alive. After, you know, the three or four deaths that we incurred. Obviously, not the most ideal Trudon. Get out of my face. Why? I'm so glad I didn't run into you three seconds ago. Oh, that would have been horrid. Um, you know what? Now's my chance. Wood. Wood. Yes. We got it. We got it. And got the spyglass. We got a spyglass. We got the spyglass. I got a spyglass. And something's trying to fight me. But I'm gonna go home because I don't like this place. And I'm a little bit homesick. And I'm sick of dying. Ah. <sighs> I think I should <laughs> I could have just taken this shortcut and we're gonna just bypass everything well now that I don't know that's there I'll I'll do that next time oh piranha leave it mate just leave it unless you want to die all right fantastic we're home in one piece and I can finally drink some water <laughs> yes all right okay so we've got crystal we've managed to finally get our, I probably should have got some more while we were down there. But now that we know that it's there, uh, we can obviously go and regather it when we need to. Uh, I'm going to get a water vial because right now that seems to be one of our massive shortcomings in that I... Oh, and cementing paste, of course, too. Um, but hey, we got some chitin out of that whole situation, didn't we? Did we? Did I? Have you got any on you? You helped me a little bit. Yeah, you got a little bit. Um, you, you gathered a bunch of stuff. Good for you, mate. Good for you. Um, I don't think I got much chitin on me. Oh, here it is. Oh, we got heaps of chitin. We got heaps of stone. Uh, I only need like eight cementing paste. So just get it in there and craft the stuff up. And then, well, I don't know. I can I can head inland now without like starving all the time of, of water. Can you starve of water? Just the lack of water. You, you know what I, you know what I'm saying. There we go. All right. There we are. We got another level up our sleeve. I'm putting that in stamina. Just, I keep running out of stamina and I don't like it. And with that level, we have unlocked the long neck rifle. Beautiful. Simple rifle ammo. We don't quite have narcotics yet, but this is going to be a massive step in the right direction. We also got display cases for cheapies. That's new. Awesome. I don't know how to get cheapies though, but 
That's awesome. Can you get chibis? How do you get chibis in the regular arc? I thought you got to be on like different maps. I don't even know. I can't even remember how to gather the things. We also got a Sarko saddle, which is pretty cool because this area that we're currently in is notorious for Sarkos. We might even be able to get one just from over in that direction. So we'll see how that goes. Well, guys, I'm going to wrap this one up here. Thank you so much for watching. Tomorrow, maybe we'll find a little bit of a stronger team. At least now I can afford some saddles, so we can actually learn some saddles. I'm talking about you, Sarko. I think a Sarko would be absolutely fantastic right this second. In saying that, though, this guy. Massive get. Massive get. He's already got a level up his sleeve. Let's go and put it into health so he might be able to actually survive. <laughs> survive a little while. And I think I am going to give you... A name. A very old school name. It's got to be the rap god, baby. The rap god is back. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and thump your chest. Or in your instance, go thump that thumbs up. Guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one tomorrow. Um, again, we're doing this. That's not how we say goodbye. We don't threaten people by... Uh, guys, bye for now.